Hey guys, what's popping? How is this going? So guys, you guys, I know it's been long you've seen me here yeah, because of the exam stress and everything. We've been writing the exams and you know, trying to pass the way. And guys, throughout last week, I've been sleeping like four weeks, you know, by six because of school. You know, we have to pass, we have to move to the next level. And guys, my next level, I'm in 300 level, it's semi finalist. And I'll be so good. Anyways, guys, thank you guys for the wish. I know you guys wish me, so thank you guys for the wish wishes. Anyways, so today I'm going to be doing something unusual, a story time video on how I got scammed. Yeah, I got scammed, guys. Like how stupid of me get scammed. Like how? Oh. But anyways, um, I got scammed with a huge amount of money. So let's just. And before I start, actually, guys, before I start, I have good friends in this life. Number one important thing. I have good friends. That's the vibe. That's yeah, so guys, um, this is I started. So like three weeks back, Zenit Bank, uh, Zenit Bank, Zenit Bank has been having um, issues with our network. I don't know what the hell went wrong then. And for those of you that know, I use Zenit Bank. I, I use Zenit Bank. Why am I saying banks? I use Zenit Bank. And so um, they charged me. You know this time they charge, they charge. They just charge us once a month, right? But they charged me three times a month, 450 for the first one, 450 for the second one, and 300 for the first one. Hey, Joe, she was just Bill Gates, don't charge me 450. I'm making monta. What am I saying? What am I doing that they charge me 450 three times a month? Hey, Joe. But, anyways, so I could not withdraw, nothing, nothing. I was broke that period, and I'm in school. How do you expect me to survive without no money in school? And I was in school, I was broke, nothing, nothing. And my parents sent me money on Thursday, okay, like, okay, you have to, you know, and hold yourself. But I could not do anything. You know, because of the little change I had with me at told then I would have just died. I would have died. By that way, um, so on when oh, yeah, on Sunday, I never went to Twitter. I was like Zenit Bank, because that was the la last time they charged me that 300 now. So I was like, I'm Zenit Bank, why are you guys charging me this um, ridiculous amount? I'll put the picture here. That why are you guys charging me this ridiculous amount? Then someone now replied, not up to five minutes, someone now replied, which was using Zenny Bank logo, but I did not check the name. Until I saw the logo light for like, thank God they replied that forward all this your information to this WhatsApp line. And before I go, my DST, when time it expires or have issues, there's this WhatsApp line I use that they help me and do it back immediately. And my, one of my friends said GT Bank has um, this the WhatsApp line also that they use. So I was like, okay, oh, maybe Zenny Bank will have upgraded to WhatsApp, guys. So that was how and I went to went to the WhatsApp. I'll also post the picture there. And she that the person was chatting with me like a real customer person, like scammer no. Only sense to, to uh, we all scammer was sense for them to be able to scam you. We are the, you don't know that be stupid enough. You won't be stupid enough for them to scam you. But what, what am I saying? You guys should understand what I'm saying. So the person now said, okay, what was the, do you want to open the account? Some 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 something. I'll post the picture, then you guys will see it. I said number one, like that, like that. Like that, to the person has to send your ATM details. That's the number one thing I've done. That okay, this person is trying to scam me, but no, he never clicked my mind. I was like, just do what you want to do and let me just get my money and spend. Like, you know, we have to make money and spend money. That's the vibe, you know. <laughs> so, I sent the person my ATM card details. The person I said, okay, they'll send me one password, or like password, or like OTP, like, okay. OTP guys, you no know OTP is like one of the main things. Like, immediately you send someone your OTP like that, they're removing your money immediately from your account straight up. But I never also catch the street, catch the scope, cut the scope. Anyone, I never, I never also caught the scope. Like, okay, this person was trying to scam me. The person now removed. Okay, okay, wait, I first sent the person my OTP code, then like that. Too. The person comes to move 5k for my account. Immediately, the person moved 5k for my account. Immediately, I went to Zenith Bank mobile banking app. Oh, God, do let this that thing work. Oh, let's not gonna remove person money from my account. So, and let's work my script very slow. And I'm using it, and Ethel has been so shit as fuck for a long period of time, which I don't still understand why Ethel is also doing that. That's how I was trying to like block my um, ATM because so the person would be able to remove the remaining money from my account, but it was too late. The person first removed 5k, then the person removed. The person removed 60,000. Let's say all together, the person removed 65,889 naira. Guys, the person removed my own money finish. Like, guys, I, 
Well, let's say actually, after the person removed the money, my body was shaking out because I left my friend's room, came to my room, my body was shaking, then I cried. I cried for just maybe two minutes. I was talking to my friend that was busy. I cried. Then, ah, oh my guys, you know, it's you. And funny enough, some money that is there, 60,000 that is there, is one of my friend's money. And it was not my money at all. That's why I was like, in this life, I have good friends. You remember when I said that earlier? I have good friends. Then the person, I actually have to tell my friend that, okay, please let me gather money. And I actually had savings, so I removed all my savings. We have to pay the person back and some, some of my friends helped me to gather the remaining money at least within a week i paid back the person the 60k back but at the same time guys i saw it was so painful because i couldn't even tell my friend that someone scammed me of 60k i only, I only told them about my money and i told my uh, my uh, one of my cousins so I, at least at least they were sending me money so i didn't have i was broke like more than i'm still saying to do one or two things person do and the way about that scammer is god will punish you like God punish that person. Why you have done that? <laughs> if there's another thing I can say again, God should just do everything to you. Because it's really painful. Like, why don't scammer or whoever had scammer, why don't you guys work for your money or try to do something? Like, why scam other people why or don't scammer work for that hard earned money? Like, spending other people hard earned money and you guys are always happy with it. But, anyways, all the best for you guys because you guys can't even go scotch free. If you don't survive for years, like, all the most down. Nemesis will catch up normal. If you don't suffer for it, you're streaming my spot because I don't understand why you actually be stealing other people hard earn money. Now I feel why people when people get scammed they were like oh some of them might even kill themselves. Thank God I even had friends that can pay my um, the person that I'm always sticking back. Thank God I had friends. That I'm in this life, they just have good friends and I'm so grateful to my friends and I know they're going to watch this video. Shout out to you guys, I love you all. Thank you guys for just supporting me and Making me pay the, me, my, the money back I mean and for believing me also because I'm more it takes the ads in again for people to believe and to also drop not even like let me borrow like dash you some huge amount of money. It takes some huge steps. Okay, so thank you, I really love you all. And so that's how I got scammed. And guys, also learn your lesson, you know, don't let them scam you. Imagine come back in you. Don't let them scam you guys. Just have sense in this life. Like me too. Then I never had sense, but now I have sense. That's how life is. Move. And guys, also make your money, work out your money, and yeah, you may enjoy it. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, give it a big thumbs up, like, comment, share, subscribe, tell a friend, 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 if you don't want, if you don't to, just tell a friend, guys, please the subscribe button, let's, let's get to 200 subscribers, we are almost there, let's get to 200 subscribers, then. and as from today, guys, I'm doing my exams, but I'm going for a um, series of the ice you know, um very soon so at the same time i'll try i'll try my best to even do vlog about how my experience in my it place was at the same time i'll try my best to do a vlog about this but anyway guys thank you all subscribe watch comment like tell me how this how you enjoyed this video how you liked it and if you want more maybe story time video too yeah peace out guys bye